hello and welcome to my channel please like share and subscribe if you like this video and thank you all so much for watching thank you thank you thank you to my day ones twos and threes thank you to all my new subscribers that's coming in that means well thank you all so very much i appreciate you and welcome 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 this video is for entertainment and educational purposes only so everything is alleged some is not in the fair act use is in my description box y'all so let's get to it um there's some more information coming out y'all um someone just sent me this video it's a video actually so you can go to the vault uncut on ig and look at the whole video it's just him singing or whatever this is supposed to be the guy that um one of the guys that you know hit at or hit take off y'all this guy right here this is supposed to be his actual hitter okay and I don't know why people are saying that he's the hitter instead of saying he's one of the hitters because allegedly, y'all, the other hitter is somebody from Quavo's side of the family, y'all. A family member hit him along with this guy, allegedly, okay? So, um, if this ain't messy, I don't know what it is, y'all. You get taken out by somebody on the other team that allegedly you arguing, y'all, your brother's cousin, uncle arguing with, and then you turn around and get hit up by, you know, your uncle's brother. This is what they saying, y'all. This don't make no damn sense. If this ain't messy, I don't know what is, y'all. If y'all believe that it's not this stuff that happened to this man is not lining up with that last video and all this other stuff y'all just don't make no sense and somebody brought this to my attention and you know i don't know who sweetie was messing with who she was messing with first and this net that, that and this but um i think sweetie was messing with quavo right y'all and in a video of messy somebody brought this to my attention so i have to say salute to this person who brought this to my attention you know they said, um, could Sweetie have been messing with all three of these guys, y'all? Because if the group broke up because, you know, they saying that Offset, allegedly, allegedly, Offset, you know, hit that. And, you know, Quavo got, was feeling some type of way, y'all. You know, he got a little tender packer, whack, whack a packer, okay? A little tender whack a packer. And this is why he feeling some type of way about offset because offset hit it too okay now this is what word on the street is now if y'all go back to that video of um messy then you know take off in the video start taking off his clothes so he can you know get in the bed in the video with some female and you know somebody said is this some get back too dude was was sweetie messing with offset and take off and was this you know um quavo's get back for him messing with her too now i don't know just because he quiet don't mean he ain't you know a man okay y'all he might stay to himself and stayed out of junk but you know this sweetie was she was she i don't know y'all but if she had the nerves to go mess with offset you know why stop there I'm just saying, y'all, could this been some get back? You know, he directed this video. And why did he have, you know, his nephew get in a bed with a female? And this is what him and Offset broke up over. So what's, is he trying to tell us something, y'all, that he didn't mind, you know, sacrificing him? Because possibly, did he hit it too, y'all? I'm just saying allegedly, y'all. I don't know. But I wanted to read this because somebody sent this to me. All right, y'all. It says the streets are officially talking. I've been getting so many reports from firsthand witnesses. It's crazy. The people that came forward showed me 100% proof they, um, was th they was there firsthand. But I can, ex um, wait a minute. I gotta, let me blow this up a little bit, y'all, because I can't hardly see this. I need to see what I'm seeing. Okay, where was I at? Proof that they're firsthand. But I can't expose their identities. They told me Quavo was arguing with J. Prince Jr. Okay, now here goes some old stuff they changing up. Now, y'all didn't hear. Y'all heard the last argument that was going on. 
And it looked like Quavo was arguing with somebody else. It doesn't look like Quavo was arguing with Jay Prince Jr. We didn't even see Jay Prince Jr. Okay? I'm not saying he wasn't there because we seen him walk out. But um y'all that's going over for what, what the new stuff that's coming out. I told y'all every time something gonna come out, it's gonna be a twist, it's gonna be a turn, it's gonna be so many different scenarios that it's gonna be ridiculous. And this is how they did that's how they did Mo 3 and Young Dolph. So let's keep going, y'all. So now Quavo and now they got Quavo and Jay Prince Jr. Are arguing. He shrugged he shrugged Jay Prince Jr. off and walked away, saying, Let's go before I hurt somebody. Immediately after takeoff was following behind the entourage to leave and yellow hoodie who goes by the name of little cam grabbed takeoff and hit him in the head y'all this is what they saying and then tried to use his body as a shield when takeoff began to fall Oh, y'all, here we go with another scenario. Remember the messages said first shot um, takeoff drop. That's when Quavo's manager pulled out his toy. Now, if they're talking about Quavo's manager, the one that had the black on with the um, toy already out, then that don't make no sense because he had already had his out and waiting. So before Quavo even, before, before everything even cooked, y'all, do y'all see how stuff is just all over the place? Before Quavo and this guy that he was arguing with even got into a serious, 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 that it could have even gotten to that, which it never turned out to be serious because it seemed kind of corny. The argument seemed like it was corny. It seemed like it was staged for them. This was a play for the, how it was going to take place. This is how it seems to me. And this don't make no sense right here because we ain't stupid. We see the guy in the black with that bag on the side, okay? We see he had been had his toy out before somebody even walked up to takeoff, okay? Let's go back over this again. Immediately after takeoff was following behind the entourage to leave and yellow hoodie who goes by the name of Little Cam, grabbed Takeoff and hit him in the head, then tried and used his body as a shield when Takeoff began to fall. Remember the messages uh, and first shot. Takeoff dropped. That's when Quavo's manager, okay, this, see, this don't make no sense. Takeoff fa falls, and this is when Quavo's manager pulled out his toy. That's a damn lie. This a damn lie. So somebody's lying and people that saying that they saw stuff firsthand, they turning this stuff around again. Okay. We all saw the guy that was in the back of that car. Okay. We all saw that guy with his stuff out already before anybody even grabbed or hit anybody or he had been had that toy out y'all. He been had it out as if he was waiting for his turn to play his part in the scene. Y'all, I this I don't believe this. I can't believe this because I know what I saw. And I saw somebody with a toy out already. Okay? Let's keep going because th this upsets me when I know somebody seems like they're lying. Um, takeoffs drop. That's when Quavo manager pulled out his toy. It was not a stray bullet. Okay, so now they saying it ain't straight because we all know it ain't no straight. Ain't no, ain't no way in the world that two different people from two different toys, stray bullets is going to hit the same person. This seems like he was the target on both sides, y'all. Quavo's manager seen the whole thing and tried to protect takeoff. Okay, now here we go. They trying to, okay, here we go. And it's actually believed that Quavo's manager might have actually hit the girl sydney okay now we find it out in the head okay so some female got hit in the head y'all but they said that they were fine so did she get graced okay and her name is sydney okay um I, I just asked who was the other girl it was on accident okay everything is accident let them tell it y'all and she survived the hospital have officially removed her tubes out of out and she's in stable condition Quavo's assistance was also hit, but two survived, and 
As for Yellow Hoodie, I've heard the team is allegedly hiding him. Is they hiding him or is they about to take him out, y'all? Ask yourself this question. If they take him out, then they everybody put everything on him and then everybody, y'all see what I'm talking about? Is they hiding him out or is they trying to decide if they about to, to take him out, y'all? Okay? His job is to protect J. Prince Jr. My source said as of yesterday, the entire J. Prince Jr. team is shook. Y'all, since all the evidence is out, everyone is talking and telling how this all started because of him and they are now receiving many threats from Takeoff's family and associates. However, the father, J. Prince Jr. Sr. and Jazz Prince has nothing to do with it. Oh, see? Do y'all see how when, okay? Do y'all see how when new people, okay, this is supposed to be somebody new. I just want y'all to pay attention. This is supposed to be somebody new that just came forward. They are already defending Quavo. They're also defending J. Prince Jr. In J. Prince Jazz and all of them Okay I just pay attention to this y'all I keep telling y'all all the witnesses That's coming forth is defending everybody So it can all look like an accident I keep telling y'all they about to try to brush this under the rug Um What was I at Has nothing to do with it and J. Prince Senior has Made it clear in his Cryptic caption Swipe they both were not There when the hidden an argument occurred. Also, Prince, no yellow hoodie did it. Um, okay, he knows he did it. We know he know who did it. You know, it's they people. But they're playing it safe until they catch him. I, I thought they said they was hiding him out. Now they're saying they're playing it safe till they catch him. You see what I'm saying, y'all? This is some bull crap. And I'm reading this with y'all for the first time. Because I looked at it and I was like, let me put it, read this with my subscribers. Everybody knows and is telling exactly what went down. Really? Is they really telling what went down? Because <laughs> this is another storyline right here. Swipe um, for all the evidence. It's about to get ugly outside. Reality is officially set in for takeoffs people and they're devastated. Okay, y'all. I watched it with y'all. I went over this whole little clip with y'all. And I'm telling y'all right when I'm reading it. How I feel about the whole little thing that just came out. I feel like this is another twist and turn. Because this thing right here. This is what they just said. Now they said they're trying. They're waiting until they catch him. But they're playing it safe until they catch him. They playing it safe until they catch him. They said they already had him had now. So how can you say they had him out? At the top, I've heard the team is allegedly hiding him. If they're hiding him, how the hell is they waiting on to catch him? Okay? Okay, y'all. Y'all already know how I feel about this. Another twist and turn to the story. Anyway, y'all, please like, share, and subscribe if you liked this video. And thanks for watching, y'all. Peace.